take our lead. Let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. 10. If you can stand it, check out the tick. If it is alive and waving its legs, you removed the whole thing and didn't leave mouth parts or head behind. If it is dead and not waving, your dog is still going to be okay. Make your mark, take our lead. Pull upward with steady, even pressure. Don't twist or jerk the tick. This can cause the mouth parts to break off and remain in the skin. If this happens, remove the mouth parts with tweezers. If you are unable to remove the mouth easily with clean tweezers, leave it alone and let the skin heal. Take our lead. Let's help you make your mark. Never dig around in the skin to remove the remainder of the tick, as this can actually increase the risk of skin infections. Instead, it's best to let nature take its course. Your dog's body will expel the tick out naturally by itself. To avoid the possibility of infection, apply an antibiotic ointment, as directed. Make your mark, take our lead. No matter how long a tick is attached, it will never disappear inside the body. However, the longer a tick is allowed to feed, the higher the risk is of a disease resulting. Myth 11 If you leave a tick's head in it will grow a new body. Incorrect. Make your mark, take our lead. If the tick is accidentally pulled apart and the head stays in the skin, there's a risk of being infected with other microscopic organisms. This kind of infection has nothing to do with Lyme disease, but can still be dangerous and unpleasant. See a doctor if part of the tick is left in the skin or if infection occurs. Make your mark, take our lead. Just like our human skin, a dog's skin will change from day to day and over time it will age. You may notice differences such as a change in texture, or even lumps or bumps. These may be a harmless skin tag or scab, but sometimes they can also indicate a tick bite, which can spread diseases to your pet. Make your mark, take our lead. Most vets will say that you do not need to take your dog to the vet after a tick bite, but you should monitor your dog for signs or symptoms of Lyme disease for the next several weeks or months. Rest assured knowing that only 10% of dogs that contract Lyme disease will develop symptoms of the illness. Take our lead. Tick bite reactions are more likely to lead to a firm lump granuloma. Common foreign bodies that can cause a reactive lump in your pet's skin include grass seeds and thorns. A reaction to a foreign body may also be infected and or painful. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and hit the bell notification.